My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. We got a hot little number for you. It's a 1970 Nova. There's a 383 stroker motor under the hood, a four-speed transmission, 373 posi, and all upgraded QA1 suspension. This thing's a blast to run around with. You can go to volocars.com. That's where you can read all the information. That's where you can study over 100 pictures top to bottom. And that's where you find price tags on over 200 collector cars, all for sale. That's at volocars.com. If you enjoy these videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on the bell icon, that way you're notified as the new ones are posted. But right now, join me, let's go for a spin. Yeah, there's a lot going on underneath this car. It has a QA1 sports suspension. Uh, up front, it's all new, the ball joints, bushings, uh, all that's new. And what's upgraded is the tubular control arms, upper and lower, and it has coil over adjustable gas shocks. The rear suspension's all new. Uh, it has QA1 adjustable gas shocks. It has new leaf springs and bushings. Uh, it has tubular control arms. Uh, and the front is tied to the back with frame connectors that prevent the body twist. So they got the stance set up real nice. Everything's adjusted. It's a good riding and handling uh, car. The fuel system's new. The tank, the straps, even the little insulators between the straps, sending unit, fuel lines, has a new electric fuel pump in line. Uh, you look up at the motor, it has an extra capacity custom oil pan, high torque starter with the insulation wrap around it. Uh, it's got a Muncie four speed transmission with a new Hurst linkage. Uh, looks like the U joints were replaced. In back is a 12 volt posi with 373 gears and a chrome cover. Uh, the brakes have been redone. Up front is disc, upgraded with drilled and slotted rotors. Uh, it's got custom dual exhaust with a crossover pipe and Flowmaster mufflers. The floors under the car, the metals, all solid. Everything's painted nicely in like a semi gloss black. The body itself is very nice. You look down the sides, across the roof. I walked around the car. I felt along the bottoms right before we started the video. This is all nice, uh, straight. The body looks real good on the car. It fits nicely. Uh, the paint job, custom two-tone, obviously, metallic silver. Uh, the blue, I don't, yeah, there is metal flake in the blue, real tiny metal flake. It's a very smooth, glossy finish. It's not a $25,000 paint job. There's a little bit of orange peel, you know, minor, minor, you know, piece of dust in the paint here or there, but it shows really well overall. Uh, there's a chip right here. Someone must have slammed the trunk a little too hard at one time. Tail lights, bumper are replaced. Trunk fits nice and square. Got some really nice polished American racing aluminum wheels. They're 17 inch performance tires. The marker lights are new. Door handles are new. Bow tie mirrors are new. All this trim around the window frame is new. Although this one here is kind of bent up. It must have fell off and someone tried putting it back on with a hammer. Windshield's new. The rest of the glass is original. Wipers are shiny. Has the SS hood, these grills are new. Everything up front's new. The trim, the grill, the bezels, the lenses, the bumper, and upgraded HID headlights. And here we go. So like I said, 3D3 stroker motor, aluminum heads, Edelbrock aluminum heads, the end intake, a 670 Holley dual feed carb with electric choke. It's got some premium fuel lines, fittings, regulator, gauge. Uh, it has headers, complete MSD ignition system. 
The front of the motor has the March uh, billet uh, system, which includes the billet pulleys with serpentine belt, the brackets, aluminum alternator, chrome uh, power steering pump, big aluminum radiator with a stainless shroud and dual electric fans, aluminum uh, water pump, I don't know if I mentioned that, overflow bottle. Inside the trunk is rock solid metal. Under the trunk lid and the jam is smooth and glossy silver, has new weather strip, and it's got a stereo system. We got a big speaker box with two Rockford Fosgate uh, subwoofers, they're 10 or 12 inch, two amplifiers, a Rockford and a Kenwood, six by nine speakers in back, round speakers in the kick panels. A uh, nice interior. It's got some sports seats, and these seats hold you in place when you're going around the corners. The old bench seats in these cars, you slide all over, but these hold you in real nice. They've added retractable three-point seat belts for the front. Uh, new door panels, front and back, has billet handles. The headliner was replaced. Carpet was replaced. There's bow tie uh, floor mats on the floor. Uh, we got power brake system here, um, wiper motor looks fairly new, you got braided hoses, you got a gel cell battery. The rear seat is reupholstered, the dash pad is new, the metal, someone spray can the metal, I mean it's presentable but it's not real smooth and glossy, uh, it's got a GT cushion grip wheel. Kenwood stereo system. Uh, it's got uh, a gauge cluster below the dash and a big tachometer on the uh, column on the other side. Armrests are new. Door jams are painted nice. Sill plates are shiny. So it's not a real high-end build, but it's got all the fun stuff. The stroker and suspension and posi and four-speed, and it looks really sharp. So there you have it. That's my impression of this car. The upper control arms are chrome. So you can go to volocars.com. Plenty of ways to talk to the salesman. If you have any specific questions or concerns, please ask. They will help the best they can. They can also help get this delivered to your driveway. And they can help you get financed as well. Couple speaker, or uh, not speakers, a couple trophies over there in the box that go with the car, too. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on that bell icon, that way you'll be the first to see the next one posted. Thanks for watching.